if you are you know unfamiliar with online if you're not sure what to do to keep your business sort of out there online here's a few quick tips firstly make sure you've got a website for a start if you don't have a website get in contact with me I'll look after you secondly make sure you post to that website so write articles write blog posts what are what are the five common things that customers ask you every single day sit down once every and write one every day write an article every day on a question that someone asks you a lot how much does it cost what are the benefits of um, you know where do you source your product from what can I how long does it take to see results write little short blurbs like like frequently asked questions but a bit more detailed than that and post them on your website over time when people who are looking for your product or service are searching those same sort of questions you know how long does it take to build a new home um, how does chiropractic care help my back you know, you're more likely to show up in those searches so start writing content for your website put it on your website next thing is Google my business if you don't have one of those pages already go set one up right now little secret inside a tip for you if you don't know already if your company name on Google my business and let me just explain Google my business quickly guys I won't jump into it too quick Google my business you search for let's say a restaurant on Google you'll see a map come up and you'll see businesses come up on the side those are Google my business listings you want to make sure that you're in there if you're not in there already go set yourself up go to business.google.com and register now back to the title so make sure your business name has the keyword or the key phrase of the product or service you offer so for example I had a client who does house washing his company name said nothing about house washing it was just a generic business name once he put the word house washing in his Google my business profile he then started coming up in Pupakoe when people searched house washing simple make sure you do that if your company name doesn't clearly already state the product or service that you offer another thing that you can do is keep in touch with your existing customers so if you're a brand new you know brand new business it might be a bit tricky but if you have existing customers even if it's 20 customers get all their email addresses put them into Mailchimp and start sending them regular emails once a week once every two weeks and keep in touch with them now don't just hammer them and try and sell them stuff actually add value give them beneficial information again referring back to even the questions that they might commonly ask or perhaps you've got some helpful advice for them like if you're an accountant for example during this COVID-19 you know dilemma it could be a good time that you actually say to people hey look here's what the government's planning to do in regards to your tax or here's some things you can buy to you know write off now because the government are being easy on them whatever it might be you know I'm no expert in that area but what can you do what can you add value you know what can you add value to your customers during this period use Mailchimp to do that now finally one other thing I'll give you is use social media if you don't use it just get into it we've, we've all got plenty of time really at the moment to focus on and learn new technologies and new things so use social media like Facebook and Instagram to post updates post information on what you do or what you've been working on that might be now on hold and another final tip guys if you're using the likes of Excel or a you know old-fashioned paper notepad or a, a paper invoice book everything's changing everything's going online go and sign up on my uh, software website Zulu go and set up a free trial on Zulu if I see you on there I'll give you a 90-day free trial you don't obviously need any credit cards or anything it's totally free you can give it a go but it's basically a one-stop shop to list all your customers do your quotes manage your timesheets even manage your staff's timesheets you can also set up digital forms health and safety forms it's got lots of features I don't want to sort of overburden you at the moment but go and sign up for a trial and I'll give you 90 days free access to it and I'll also show you how to use it obviously being an existing follower of ours so stay safe out there if you do have any questions please email us and we'll be happy to help